Across the country, communities are investing in urban neighborhoods and struggling with the consequences of gentrification, displacing longtime residents due to rising rents, redevelopment, and increasing property values. Here in Columbus, Wineland Park is a shining example of responsible and respectful integration of a neighborhood, a sustainable development that is exemplary of the ULI mission. What I really liked about this project was that it was really about the people and it looking at the people as an asset to the community. It gives um, the opportunity to, for people to have affordable housing in a, in a downtown area. Wineland Park was able to collaborate with the, the current residents and they were able to have a say in the, in the changing of the neighborhood, which, which is a really creative solution to maintaining the, uh, the, the integrity of the neighborhood while still increasing the value of the area. The first step in the transformation of Wineland Park was taken in 2003 when the Ohio State University and Ohio Capital Corporation for Housing acquired and stabilized more than 325 affordable Section 8 housing units through effective management and renovation. Recognizing that Wineland Park's proximity to Ohio State's campus and the Short North neighborhood made it susceptible to gentrification. The Wineland Park Collaborative was formed in 2008 with an innovative strategy. It provided families with affordable opportunities for rental, lease to purchase, and home ownership, while making critical investments in workforce development, education, health, and more. The turning point in the housing market came in 2014 with Wineland Park Collaborative's private partner, Wagon Brenner Development, renovating 90 market rate apartments and selling the first market rate home. An unprecedented collaboration among 21 public and private entities has transformed Wineland Park from a distressed neighborhood into a true mixed income, racially diverse community. The kind of the quintessential example of collaboration amongst a number of different community members really united in a way to recapture an important neighborhood. Today, Wineland Park is a desirable neighborhood, experiencing its first population increase in 70 years. New market rate housing is being built on previously vacant land, an investment unthinkable in 2010, given the neighborhood's condition. To take a community that was not safe and to renovate, to invest, invest in the people, the neighborhood. They wanted to make this a place that's safe for their children and their grandchildren and for themselves. Um, it's an amazing, um, successful example of what happens when different stakeholders in the community come together to make a safe place to live.